go to the whiteboard and we'll get this. Okay, so the first portion of this morning's training is gonna be all about that hard work. We really like to set the intent early on. And Rascal, we go through this same workout at the start and at the end of every camp that he does. So it really, really helps him with his mental resilience. It really sets the tone and it's all about that mental clarity as well. So this should help simulate exactly what we're doing on the gym floor and, and create that same intensity that he experiences inside the wrestling ring as well. So the stuff that we do in here, inside the gym, is gonna translate perfectly for when he's in that wrestling ring. What is it that we're gonna be doing today that will give us the most amount of muscular recruitment, that emphasis on power, and just create that extra bit of snap for when Rascal really needs it the most. If he's competing against other top level athletes, we want him to be that next level. So already, what separates a good athlete from a great one is gonna be that ability to dig that little bit deeper and create that mindfulness connection between who they are and what they do. So we put to the emphasis today on the why behind we do what we do, and then we back that up with the science of the training. Go, go, go. Everything that we do today is of paramount importance, and we will carry that on throughout the rest of the training camp. We work with a little bit more of a periodization sort of approach. It's a pretty common practice, but how I approach this as a coach with having a top level athlete like Rascal underneath my wing, it's gonna be absolutely amazing. The results speak for themselves. We wanna think a little bit deeper about the exercises that we choose to do that will give us the, the most amount of translation from the gym floor and back into that wrestling ring. So we're gonna be really, really cerebral with our approach. And up, come on, time. 